NICE is a national initiative for cybersecurity education. This is an initiative um, being directed by NIST. And as NIST has indicated as part of this initiative, um, it is to create a unified framework uh, for the workers and the organization. With a framework such as this, organizations can have a skills gap assessment of where the skills are, where the gaps are, which are the areas they would need to create more skills and train their individuals and have a strong cybersecurity workforce. They will be able to now clearly say this is the industry terminology for this role and these are the skill sets required for that and everybody is using a common taxonomy. So within the DOD, the various agencies and other federal agencies, they're all using a common taxonomy plus also this will help with the private sector. You will see there are seven categories there. These are the functional categories within which all the job roles fall under. And within these seven categories, there are about 35 job titles. And what Secure Ninja has done is looking at these job titles, we have identified what are the skill sets these individuals should possess to carry out the function required for this job title. And within this, we have also identified the core must have skill sets and the areas of specialization, depending on one of the job titles that they may be using, and also something which is pertinent to their organization's needs. So now let's look at it from an individual's perspective. By looking at our chart that Secure Ninja has created, they can look at where they are today and what is their target. Based on where the target is, they can now identify what are the steps to take to get to this place. Now let's look at it from an, a manager or management perspective. Every organization has a finite amount of dollars to spend a training budget. So the key thing is how to maximize that training budget. With this chart, they will now be able to prioritize which courses their workforce, their team members would uh, benefit from, and they could have targeted approaches to identifying a skills gap, and it will be able to quantify easily what is the organization getting for the dollars they are spending? One of the common questions I've heard from students and from management alike is the students are asking, well, I have done this. What, what are the type of jobs I can try for? From a management perspective, they are looking at, based on our nature of work, what we need to do here, how we, the functional teams that we have, which are the courses we should center because they would be getting conflicting reports. Um, uh, perhaps I should do this, perhaps it's based on hearsay. Now with uh, the nice uh, job titles, which most of the federal agencies are relating to, and can relate to very easily now, and because everyone is saying the same thing, they can now identify, well, if this is the role of my team member, then of my staff, I can plan out their career path in this manner, and perhaps even include it in their performance uh, objectives. So they can now prioritize their dollars on the courses that really matter to their organization. So it helps from both directions, the individuals and the management alike.